Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill. Today we are going to talk about the battle pass. So, a lot of people are confused how battle pass works, right? And people did the maths and they are looking into the tokens and they are saying skill, you cannot get enough tokens to get um, Panzer or to get Baza. Fellas, you can and you will. Keep this in mind. The most important thing what you need to understand is Battle Pass tokens are valid until the, until the end of this year or something until December, right? This is very important thing to say. Whenever you will finish Battle Pass, then you need to spend the uh, points, right? To get the bonds or whatever you want to get. But tokens you are having them valid until December. That's how you can afford to take the tanks. And now, very, very important thing to say. Uh, I've seen some people uh, misunderstanding um, the feature when you can buy the bounty equipment. Uh, some people are thinking, okay, I will have 20 points, so I am going to buy those pieces. No, fellas, you can buy only one each three months. So the best way to spend the tokens, at least in my humble opinion, is to buy the equipment pieces once in three months, so in total three in a year, and in the same time to spend everything rest for tanks, right? As an example, currently we have a new bounty hardening, so if you are playing with the heavy tanks, I would recommend to do that. And as you can see, I bought it, and now I cannot buy it anymore. That's it. Game over. You know, there is nothing more to buy. So keep this in mind. It is extremely important thing to say. And now talking about the tanks, I still haven't tested the Kapaza and I haven't tested Baza, but my prediction is Baza is going to be a Kaku tank, it's not going to be a good vehicle. Uh, this is my prediction, right? And speaking about the Kapaza, it's going to be very, very niche tank like Kunze Panzer, but worse. This is, this is what I think, right? Obviously, I'm not going to raid the tanks now because I haven't played with them, but what I can do, I can talk about the older tanks I played. And by the way, keep this in mind, whenever I will get my hands on those vehicles, index page will help for you. I can promise you that. The videos are going to be in the index page and I will try to master them as soon as possible to say how the tanks are behaving. Are they okay or they are not so okay, right? It is very important thing to say. So now looking into the list of the tanks, which I know and I can recommend for people, right? There is three tanks which I recommend pretty much for most of the World of Tanks players. Um, and we are going to play with them today. So, first of all, phase one. It's kind of no-brainer, quite good here. A tank playing, hold down 340 heat penetration, beautiful. After that, we have obviously Char Futur uh, for auto loader fans. It is absolutely amazing. It can hit shots very, very easily, and it is a beautiful tank. And last but not least, Cobra. And specifically, why am I saying Cobra is a good tank? It's this vehicle is giving a lot of joy to play with, right? Yes, it is expensive tank. Yes, you need to spam quite a bit of the gold, but you will see how this tank is going to behave. And in fact, we are going to start everything with Cobra. Now, looking into the remaining tanks, in my opinion, Object 777 is... Sure, beginner friendly tank, but that's about it. You know, this tank has only armor until you are meeting someone who knows how to penetrate you. K91 PT, I love this vehicle. I think it is a great uh, assault tank destroyer. You are quick, you are nimble, you can go in front, but it's not easy tank to play with. Kunze Panzer is a completely different story. Uh, this tank costed me a couple of the gray hair in the side on the side of my um beautiful head, right, and Kunze Panzer, even though it is a good tank, it is extremely hard tank to play with, and it has very, very disgusting mode. If you want to be accurate, you need to go into the siege mode, and you will get your gun depression and everything, and if you do not want to do that, you will have a good DPM and good speed, but in the same time, your accuracy is going to be questionable, right? Um, it's important thing to say, and by the way, this tank has the same mechanics as Kunze, so I am not looking uh, uh, for this vehicle overall. And last but not least, we have Lorraine 50T, and Lorraine 50T, in my opinion, is uh, as much as okay tank. Very, very bad DPM, but good gun accuracy and questionable armor. On the flat ground, everyone will penetrate you if you are playing hold down. You are going to be somehow okay. So looking into all of this, fellas, that's all I can say about the battle pass 
class things, right? And now I want to play a game, one game with a face, one game with a chair footer, and one game with a cobra. Let's start with a cobra because it is the most fun, shall we? Let's go. Oh, this is going to be naughty, fellas. Looking into all of this, it is disgusting. Okay, hear me out. We are meeting the tier 7s with this vehicle. We can pretty much clip out tier 7 heavy tank in 3 seconds flat. So 4 shots tier 7 heavy tank is gone. This is going to be um, quite a disgusting one. So if it happens to be you are watching this in your living room, make sure to make the sound uh, higher if you know what I mean. It's going to be fun. Okay, I would love to get in this uh, in this much making, let's say four to five thousand. But obviously, in the end of the day, it, a lot of things are depending on the luck what we are going to get, right? And how good our team is going to look like. Um, overall, both of the choices in this game works. I could go under the bridge, or I could go into the city. I'm going into the city for a particular reason. I really want to meet someone crossing like so and just simply clip him out without even asking his name or anything. Just simply clip him out. In fact, I am, I am that brave. I am going to go even, uh, even more in. Now, this is a very, very nice position. If I will do this properly, this should be very, very good. You see, usually heavy tanks are stopping here for a moment. So what we are going to do, we are <coughs> going to be prepared for this. <coughs> I want to see T-29 coming or Tiger P coming and... Uh, oh. Yeah, tell me it's not dirty. Tell me it is not dirty. 1.5 thousand in 3 seconds. We spanked them like there is no tomorrow. They did not saw that one coming. We escaped. We lost zero hit points. <laughs> He's chasing me. <laughs> if I would be in his place, I would be angry as well. Well, as I'm telling you, this vehicle is so, so disgusting. Um, it is madness. But once again, you know, it is requiring for you to spam the gold, which is not very good for everyone, right? Um, some people have this anti-gold mentality, which is completely fine, you know? It is completely up to you how you are going to do the things. Please don't pay attention to the minimap. Too late, buddy. NT-29, watch this. NT-29, I'm going for him, I don't care. Oh. How are you doing? 3.2 thousand from the two clips, right? I'm telling you, fellas, this vehicle is absolutely nuts. You are like a cobra. You are waiting until someone will get close and after that... Ooh, absolutely amazing. Skill cobra doesn't say that. That's not the point, okay? That is not the point. We are speaking now about the time. Okay. What do we want to do next? Next will be to eliminate someone who is playing in the middle. If they do have someone, we are going to have a blast here. Now, <clears throat> or maybe I'm supposed to say they will have a blast. Okay, they are going to be blasted by us. Okay, let's see. None of the sniper schnitzels are sitting around this area. At least it doesn't look like it. Can we get a bit closer? Yes, we can. And now what I want to see, I want to take this position. From taking this position, okay, so sniping from the back, watch this. Can you see this? Good, watch. One, two, two, garage. Well, fair enough, fair enough. Close, but no banana. Two out of four, unfortunate, but the distance is significantly um, higher, if I can say so, or, or longer, right? Unfortunate, I did not really wanted to take one for the team in this situation, but I did. So at this point, I cannot cry about this. At this point, I have only one thing, which is acceptance. Meanwhile, there is a Stunner Emil, and I had a very, very nice angle on him before, but I made a decision to escape from here, and I think it is going to be better one. Now, 
what we can expect we can expect enemies to uh, start going like crazy mother truckers through the open field at least that's what i believe and that's what i uh, uh, that's what i am hoping for right and i think it will work just fine so wait for it light tank bad good we still have two in the mag we still have two in the mag fellas now the worst part of all this is my view range is very very poor i do not I am maximizing the gun hand. Oh. I am maximizing the gun handling on this vehicle because I think gun is the most important selling point of this tank. You do not really, you do not really want to have that much of of, of mobility advantage or something, right? You care only about making sure your shots will count. And oh boy, oh boy, this tank can deliver. This tank can deliver, fellas. 20 seconds left until we will reload, it is okay. We are going to be fine. Now, if we are going to see guys going through the middle, we can... Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> dream come true, dream come true. Look at this. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 1, 1. That should be a diary hit. We still have two in the magazine. I am considering... Uh, I, I want to do something and look at this. My guy. My guy. How are you doing today? Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. No, 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 no. PP raising won't help for you, my man. It won't help for you. Ramming him to death and now running for my life. This is how good and how sick this vehicle is this is how cobra can behave and will behave if you are going to make the correct decisions it is absolutely insanity and it is absolutely nuts fellas it is for me rare to say that tank is broken or tank is unbalanced or tank is absolutely disgusting in the most positive shape or form but this tank is and i believe this game uh, very very well described how this vehicle is working overall and how this vehicle can work right so here you go cobra in action let's see the score okay looks like leopard did not manage to escape without uh, getting harmed by the looks of it we hit him twice fellas excellent anyways look at this 6.6 thousand .6 raw damage we Went in and we conquered the second guy uh, by the damages, the guy with the 2000. It is insanity how good this vehicle actually is and how this vehicle can work, fellas. Trust me on this one. This is the must have tank. Obviously, you need to use your head when you are playing with this vehicle. It is not as simple as it might look like. And in the same time, 99% of the times you are going to lose credits but you need to give this tank a go and even if you are going to die right you can take someone with you four and a half seconds to cause 2000 damage if you are penetrating that is nuts okay so yeah cobra is must have let's see what do we have next on menu shall we okay fellas the second in the list char futur 4 Mwah. beautiful vehicle uh the biggest highlight of the tank is gun obviously the biggest downside of this tank four seconds between the shells some people love this tank and some people obviously hate it because it is taking quite a bit of time to shoot between the shells so you need to kind of adapt um, to make this vehicle work in a way right now it happened to be we are playing in malinovka and counter game we are top tiers so in this kind of situation i think i just simply need to be uh, relatively aggressive in fact, I am going to go for a sneaky play. I will try to take the top hill like this, and I will try to use the double bushes to pretty much spank the enemies. Never did that before, but maybe it will work. Who knows, right? I have seen others um, playing the game this way, right? It is possible to be extremely, extremely annoying while um, making this decision, so maybe that will work, right? Beautiful. We have Bizonte 
and all we need to do we need to wait until Bizonte will go tiny touch more up in fact we can start clipping him out let's see will this camo hold oh yes this camo is holding fellas oh yeah 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 very unfortunate i do not really think enemies can do something about it apart saying ay 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 dios mios that's all enemies can do and this is what this is what you can make with the tanks like this right you can uh, especially whenever you are top tier it doesn't necessarily mean you need to snipe from the back although this tank is doing this perfectly right you can as well get relatively involved and you can be pretty successful while doing so as well and as you can see camo is working just fine i do not really think many people are attempting this kind of play but you need to have a camo with a decent uh, you need to have a tank with a decent camo if you won't have a tank which which simply can shoot via the double bush well it's going to be kind of brutal destiny for you Aka, you will take one for the team and it is going to be kind of game over then you are definitely not going to enjoy yourself moving on next i want to get involved even more and at this point we are going to start punishing Ooh, caro p um 88 my girl loves this tank i can promise you that fellas okay let's run away a bit because we are getting spotted okay i want to reload listen we need to relocate we need to relocate it is a family joke okay whenever she is going to uh, see the video if she will uh, she is it will it will make a smile on her face the other day i was streaming <laughs> and, I hear, <laughs> and i hear from the other room Blood! and i asked what happened she said i was playing with a car of p88 so you know i believe she will appreciate this it happens for all of us boys and girls <laughs> it happens for all of us anyways let's see what we can do in this game <clears throat> oh <laughs> king tiger <laughs> uh, look at this beautiful yeah that is mean okay i'm trying to play the game here boy meanwhile board is trying to rush through the middle of the field he's a submarine he's a submarine unfortunate okay uh, a bit of fun in the world of tanks is fine i think it is uh, it is legit um story right fellas what do you think about this no you know what i am going to go up just like so actually no i am going to make a hardcore pressure am i all the time spotted it looks like it so wait if I am all the time spotted, who is spotting me? What is the chance they have a spotter in this uh, typical bush? This is the question. What is the chance there is a spotter in the typical bush? This is karma for making fun of, of my girl's experience to play the game, fellas. I apologize. Okay, hear me out. I have a feeling they have someone over there, okay? At this point, I should not be spotted unless someone is sitting here, which also could be a possibility, but very, very unlikely, okay? Here is the spotter. Okay. Udes. Understood. Understood. Okay, that would explain absolutely everything. If it is the case, right, and if Udes is sitting somewhere around this area, then, uh, um, then it makes sense. Where exactly he is sitting at? Okay, let's let's try to find him. Yeah. I know exactly how this position is working. I know exactly how it works, fellas. I am taking this bush myself very, very often. That is that is a very, very, very smart play by this gentleman. Extremely smart play. Okay, hear me out. It's not Udes, it's Comet. Okay, one. Two. Three. Should be here. Four. I truly think um, he might sit here. I mean, there is a tree fallen here, so maybe he is sitting in this position as well. Who knows? Okay, it's time to escape. It's time to dig the spotter. It is time to look 
a bit more seriously into this game, right? Not Comet, Ti not Tiger, Ru. Ru is the spotter. Ru is the spotter. Okay, here you go. He escaped. He took two for the team. Okay, understood. Very, very, very smart play. He costed a lot um, for us and for our team. He's, he got so much assisting damage, it is madness. But that was a very, very smart play while I was giggling for inside joke, fellas. Oh, well, what can I do? Anyways, skill, focus on the game. Enough of hee hee, ha ha. You need to win this. I agree, fellas, we need to win this. Let's see. So, Mr. Comet, how are you doing? Beautiful. Comet lately got buffed, so... He's having a blast in this game, for sure. Uh, let's go for a heat clip. The main reason why we are going for a heat clip at this point is because we have only three standards. And even then it is going to be extremely, extremely hard to do something for us. But we will try to do our best. Vaka in the middle of the field. I could spot Vaka. I could spot Vaka and I could actually clip him fully. definitely could do that but the question is is it worth it the question is is it worth it I need to figure out how to play this game right I need to figure out how to make the proper decisions which will bring us the most use of all this it is still going to be extremely hard for enemies to take us down okay um, it is extremely, extremely, extremely hard. By the way, the shell velocity with a standard ammunition is glorious. 1.4 thousand is amazing. With hits, we have 1060, so it's a bit worse than with the uh, APCRs, but um, in this situation, I do not really have any other choice, to be fair with you. Unfortunate, but it is the case. In the same time, I kind of want to be close, just in case if Ru... Um, will make a bad decision, right? Oh, speaking of the bad decisions. Nah, he is going to escape in time. Or will he? Look at the gun handling. Look at the gun handling of this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful tank. Absolutely glorious. I have two in the mag at this point. What do I want to do? What do I want to do, fellas? I'm still surprised how I did not notice um, the Ru beforehand, right? But I believe I need to focus a bit more on the game. Fellas, it's late night whenever I'm recording video. I am doing that on my day off, you know, chilling uh, to the maximum. Um, and then Wild Ru appears. Unbelievable. How dare he. Two in the mag, I'm not planning to reload. I really want to catch him. If he made a decision to go on top of the hill, I believe we can spank him like there is no tomorrow. It is not going to be easy for him to do anything here. And in the same time, if someone is going to overrun the CDA, we should be able to find a decent angle very, very quickly, right? And in fact, our CDA is in the bush here. So he is feeling extremely, extremely well. Five minutes left of this game. Let's go on the reload. I know I wasted like 15 seconds while thinking to go on the reload or not to go on the reload, to go on the reload or not to go on the reload. That's completely fine. I'm, I am very, very proud of this uh, um, rule. This is a very um, unusual bush and not many people know you can take it and you can have an absolutely amazing game while doing so, right? So that is very important thing to say. Um, the worst part of all this is unfortunately, but our team, it's not like we are down on the guns, it doesn't really matter we are down on the guns. The worst thing is, um, it is very, very hard to win this, right? The Rook can be anywhere, he is a sneaky mother trucker and we know he knows how to use the bushes properly. Okay, okay, big boy, he is going to run from the hill now. Uh, he was sitting probably somewhere around this area, that would be my guess. So if he is going to be smart, he is going to escape. The main reason why he is going to escape is because he cannot do absolutely anything for us in this situation, right? This guy is officially dead. Beautiful. 
Now Mr. Ru. Okay, Ru is on top. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Nice play, buddy. Beautiful play by the Ru, but luckily for us, um, we played better. Meanwhile, there is a King Tiger. I really want to have a good, good, good angle for him. Excellent. How about now? Very, very good. If he's going to retreat a bit more, he won't retreat a bit more. We can start uh, loading the um, APCR clip. Beautiful game so far. I am enjoying myself. Not only we are having uh, um, shits and giggles and we are um, having a good time. In the same time, we are playing well. That is rear, fellas. That is rear. Okay, Vaka never ever ever spotted where he could be. This is the question. I believe we can outspot this Tiger one, okay? Don't give up. We still can do this. We still can win this. The worst part is going to be this Udes. This is going to be the worst part for us. Okay, we need to cross like this. I really doubt. Ooh, okay, understood. Understood. Let's stop here for a moment. I am sitting in the dip, so it is not easy to outspot me at this point. Okay, good. And now we are going to use some sort of bush here just to see who is sitting in the back. And as you can see, we found the guy who was who was very very naughty boy. Who is the naughty boy? You are the naughty boy. Naughty boy. Okay, very very nice. Beautiful. Still have two in the magazine, very very good. We need to eliminate him from this battle. Aha! Uh -huh. You know what you have done before? I can even show this. I can even show this. What is that? What is that? Good skill, I will dance for you and you will forgive me that I, I did something bad. I will give you I forget. I will give you I forget, my man. Nice try. When you have a moment to mess me up, you are messing me up. And after that, you are saying everything is fine. Brother, peace. Peace, my man. We are okay. No, we are not okay. Nice try, though. Nice try. Pop, 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 pop. Ooh, this is here. I need to avoid Udes art penetration. I tried to avoid Udes and I got penetrated by the art. Quite a good game, honestly. I am feeling happy how I played this one. I know I did not pay that much attention um, to the game at first. I know I took one for the team from the Mr. Um, uh, from the Mr. Ru because I should have expected that. But that is fully on me. Anyways, nevertheless, great game and we should have two blind shots as well. Plus, on top of that, I have no doubts whatsoever our team is going to win this. Come on, Ergashem, you got this. You have one of the best guns out there. You can do this. Mr. Lova, don't mind. We won't mind if you do. Just have a good time and enjoy yourself. Meanwhile, Sada is trying to spank the Vaka. Obviously, Vaka is going in front like there is no tomorrow towers there, Hashem, but it changes absolutely nothing. The worst part of all this, this game is going to be draw more likely. Um, just because our team won't be able to eliminate the Mr. Udes from the game. Meanwhile, Sadai is bouncing the side of Vaka. This is very, very unfortunate and unlucky, but it happens for the best of us. But he, he has no fear whatsoever. He is going in front. Oy, this Vaka. He's going in front, minus 500. Now, Hashem is saying, I would love to get a bit um, piece of it but yeah that's it game over game over i i messed up i tried to avoid udes and i gave my side to the art that was the worst um, situation for me ay yeah 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 nevertheless good game and i cannot wait until my girl is going to see this video i will make sure to you know, to to point out the char footer because she likes this tank. Anyways, let's see what do we have, fellas. This is that was okay game. I would say it was not okay. It was great game until the moment it wasn't, right? Looking into all of this, we have 5.7 thousand damage, which is absolutely amazing, and 2.5 thousand assisting damage. Beautiful. Meanwhile, Ru spotted 4.5 thousand. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. But luckily for us, we figured out where he was because um, some um, guys of our team pointed the direction. I wasn't thinking about that before. Anyways, let's see how enemy Caro dealt. <laughs> let's go for round number three. Oh, 
new map that's exactly what i want to see i'm being sarcastic hear me out fellas now speaking about this map overall i haven't figured out how to play with this vehicle yet right i need uh, well not this vehicle i supposed to say this map right i need to figure this out obviously the main battle is going to be in the heavy side so that's what we are going to do anyways it's not about that now it's about the tank why phase one is so beautiful and such an amazing mother tracker because with this tank you can play hold down you have a nice gun depression you have very 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 cozy um, heat ammunition which is 340 millimeters which is absolutely amazing for us i truly mean it so you are seeing a heavy tank you do not see any problems whatsoever in fact let's load hits instantly and let's have some fun let's try to punish someone what do you think about that so the first things first, what we are going to do, we are going to take some kind of hold down position over there. I still haven't figured this out, I still haven't explored the map that much, but I believe we can find something nice. As an example, this rock, what do you think about this? I think that can work very, very well. So here we go, we are near the rock and we are seeing enemy medium tank waiting until we will peek. No. I mean, since he made a decision to peek, why not to make him happy? After that, we have a Mike sitting somewhere over there, Love sitting here, 340 hit penetration, you are shredding everyone, right? And yes, obviously, you cannot say, oh, but the speed of this tank, what speed? You have no speed, right? Uh, but you have this um, hits, or those hits, I suppose to say. And by the way, platform of this vehicle is significantly better compared to the m103 right and i believe this is uh, extremely important thing to highlight fellas uh, check this tarzan out he is moving through the open field here and he is having absolute blast uh, well let him enjoy himself um, in the unlivable island and i don't really think he can do something about this by the way meanwhile i really want to highlight we have two trash 103 sniping so you know how this guy will end up uh, he will try to side scrap or he will try to cross and it is going to be pretty much game over for him and unfortunately for him there is nothing what he can do about this by the way once again i truly want to highlight this the what did this tank is he's a tourist i'm telling you uh the biggest highlight of this tank period is the is the gun right uh, or i suppose to say the penetration of the hits it is absolutely glorious by the way who died why did you die over there this is the question is it sniper schnitzels or someone else spanked you love died you see, I still do not know the angles of this map, right? So whenever you do not know the angles, you need to be extra careful because looking into all of this, there is a tiny possibility they can find a shot, but there is rock. If I would move a bit sideways, you get the point. It is a bit more of the confusion, a bit more of the frustration, and it is a bit hard to figure this out. But whenever new maps are coming, fellas, I know some people who are waiting until there is a going to be a strategy guide or something and then they are starting to play the map. So they are simply blocking the map out. That's it. They are not even playing the map. And this is actually quite legit strategy and a legit idea in the same time, right? Or they are watching content creators until content creators will come up with something uh, uh, nice and after that, you know, the things are going to be a tiny touch better. Meanwhile, what do we have? We have a MX who is uh, thinking about being aggressive and you know what, fellas? Uh, he can think as much as he wants. Okay. Peek, my man, peek. No one is waiting for you here. Our Trash 103 is having a blast here, I assume, and hi, how are you doing? Yeah, he managed to penetrate us, and now it is a game over for him. Meanwhile, Statue in the back, Statue is dead. Okay, okay, Borat sitting here, we do not really care about the Borat, let's try to deal with the concept. Obviously, while trying to keep a very, very good angles as well to avoid the crossfire from here. Let's see what we can do. Um, it suddenly became, um, this video became about this map, not about this tank, right? But this is completely normal because it is new, it is new content, it is a new map, so... Yeah, 
Yeah, this is very, very hard to play here, and I really want to highlight this. And once again, the hardest part of all this is... The hardest part of all this is the snipers over there at this point, right? I need my guys to react properly. That is okay, I should not die. And I think I will reload quicker than this guy will. Okay, we are fine, we are set, there is no Arta who could kill us, nice. Okay, at this point we need to be smart and we need to figure out how we can make a good, 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 good um, crossfire for the enemy sitting in the open field. And I think we got this. You see, it is so much of the crossfire around this area. It is absolutely madness, fellas. Absolutely madness. Nothing what I can change about this. You know, I think I highlighted the phase one pretty well overall. Unfortunately, we have the map, which is not the finest one, but it is showing you how you can play with this tank, right? All you need to do, you need to play hold down. You make, uh, you need to make a bit of the fun of the Tarzan going through the open field and overall everything went well. The worst thing. What I have done, I decided to make pressure like this because I was afraid there is no more hit points to farm. That is the worst thing, but that is completely fine. Uh, one more thing overall to highlight, speaking about the uh, battle pass tanks, right fellas? Keep this in mind. They are not premium tanks, they are special tanks, right? Um, so you are not going to make extra credits. It doesn't work this way, right? It is absolutely important thing to highlight. And one more thing, um, the Battle Pass tanks has the special uh, consumable slot aka big repair kit. So what that basically means, that basically means uh, you are not paying for your repair kit and you always have a big one, which is quite a good thing to be fair with you. Anyways, thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed yourself and uh, see you very, very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace.